Hello ladies. Uh, today we're going to read Zen Pig, The Art of Gratitude. All right, here we go. Let's see what this one's about. Eons ago, which means a long time ago, on a green grassy knoll lived a pleasant little pig who always seemed quite whole. Whoops. He enjoyed his life much more than most because he took the time to look at things close. Wherever he was, he was always there, ready and willing to be fully aware. That Zen Pig is special is what others would say, yet Zen Pig denied and said, I'll show you the way. Care for each other as much as yourself. And never lose sight that love is true wealth. And when you speak, choose your words with care. Only kindness and compassion will ease others' despair. We all make mistakes, so forgive yourself fast. Don't expect to be perfect, or happiness won't last. Never waste time thinking of the future or the past just enjoy this moment and all that it has be thankful for all that you have there is no need for more you have everything that's needed to walk through happy's door when someone's in need don't think just act give all that you can and don't hold back uh-oh, can't turn the page. Listen to my words and follow the path. Then you too will sit atop the knoll with the green, green grass. Namaste. The light in me loves the light in you. So... And that is Zen's pig. Zen pig's question for you is, what is one thing, just one, that you are grateful for? And so, Addie could write something, Alex, Abigail, Aria, Daddy, and we th you guys could all write one thing that you are grateful for. That seems like a nice activity to do. Zen pig. Don't live in the past or the future. If you keep planning everything for the future, you're never going to enjoy the moments of today. Something we got to think about all the time. I love you girls. Have a good night. I miss you. Good night.